They told me for years there was no money in podcasting. Well, they were all wrong. Um, but Fretz, you started a podcast. Fretzelmania. That's why I have you a little with third ass. Fretzelmania podcast. So tell me about. We're here on the show. There it is. Like why you got a podcast? What got you into a podcast? And how Fretzelmania was born? Well, it was mostly from listening to to you guys to uh, to rant with Ant the fourth. Well, everyone that's has been or is to this day affiliated with WrestleAttic Radio. Yeah. So it was like you guys fourth wall. Uh, I'm trying to think of the only smash this podcast mm-hmm. and uh, and Mr. Warren Hayes on YouTube and all these people are doing that and I'm like, I like wrestling. I don't have any friends who watch wrestling other than the ones that I interact with on social media. But and, and my pat my I'm passionate about retro stuff. I love some current stuff. Like I am so excited for WrestleMania. It's gonna be bollocks, but it's just gonna be so entertaining. Like when you have a lot of celebrities involved, it's yeah, it's going to be something else. So I thought I'm going to do this. I love fantasy rebooking. So even people like, you know, the, the Adam Blompier videos and all that. So I had a word note with, all right, let's see. What do I want a fantasy book? I started off with WrestleMania 15, the first WrestleMania I ever watched on pay-per-view. Mm-hmm. Like, okay. And I went back and listened to my first show and I was anxious, nervous, very, very monotone, very boring. I would book Stone Cold versus The Rock versus Mick Folk, just straight up there. And I didn't get, you didn't get frets. Like you didn't get my, my personality. Like I'm somewhat of an outgoing guy to a point where I'm like, okay, I've had enough people today. I want to go home. Mm-hmm but I'm also incredibly socially awkward, which is why I'm kind of glad I haven't done WrestleMania live with a bunch of you folks yet. Cause <laughs> you'll have enough of me at some point. Oh, we're going to like Mr. Oh, Fretz is, it is legitimately a goal of Ricky and Kay's and mine is to get you down to a show where we can all go to together. You'll stay at one of our houses. All right. We all live, we all, we all live crazy lives, but that is definitely a goal 